The request to try Salvini has come from a special tribunal in the Sicilian city of Palermo. The former interior minister has been accused of allegedly kidnapping uh, 164 migrants who waited for 19 consecutive days on board that NGO rescue ship. Now, if found guilty, Matteo Salvini may face up to 15 years in jail. He may be suspended as senator and he might lose the right to take part in the next general election. As per normal procedure in those cases, a Senate immunity panel two months ago that is formed by representatives of all political parties voted against that trial. But today, it's up to the Senate to have the final say. Now, Salvini needs at least 160 votes to be able to reject the prosecutor's request, but he can only count on 135 of them, mainly from opposition parties. It seems that the votes of 18 senators belonging to Matteo Renzi's party, Italia Viva, will be crucial to establish if Matteo Salvini's immunity will be lifted or not. This is not the only investigation concerning the alleged kidnapping of migrants uh, in which the full interior minister is involved. There's another investigation. We know that the preliminary hearing of the so-called Gregoretti trial will take place next October. Now, Matteo Salvini yesterday posted on his Facebook page. He said that he does not regret anything. He said that back then this decision had been supported by the government. And he said that as migrant arrivals keep increasing in the country, his main concern remains protecting the country's national borders.